He lied to the American people. He knew it wasn't going to disappear, but he kept telling us a miracle was coming. And just Friday, he had the gall. Think of this now. The President of the United States of America was responsible for so many deaths. I'm, I'm serious, man. I got a better idea. Elect me and I'm going to hire Dr. Fauci. Not, and we're going to fire Donald Trump. Look, is beating Donald Trump. Donald Trump keeps telling us what a great jobs president he is. Meanwhile, 330,000 of those have been lost since Trump's become president. You know, Donald Trump is going to be the first president in 90 years. That's a lot of presidents. In 90 years, who's going to finish his four years in office with fewer jobs than when he got elected to office. It's no surprise. Remember what? What about his? But let's not forget, due to COVID, who does this guy think he is? We've given to a company that isn't have all the products. Look, folks, folks, Donald, for, Donald Trump forgot. I grew up with guys like around guys like Donald Trump, but we had guys like Trump. We used to play against in, when we played ball in Scranton and Claymont. And they kind of, because they had more money than we did, kind of looked down their nose on us. I got to admit to you, I got a bit of a chip on my shoulder from serious press people. They're decent, honorable people. Well, let me tell you something. Look, I see from Scranton and Claymont, where I grew up. Look, isn't that the kind of guy you want as president? That can game the system, be a billionaire and pay 750 bucks in taxes. I'll break your necks, break your necks pay a fair share. Supreme Court nomination for one 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 Supreme Court nomination for one. Look, Donald Care doesn't understand health care. Folks, folks, it's going to cost more money, but guess how I'm going to pay for it. We're going to make sure. Meanwhile, we're busting our neck my parents before me and everyone else. And we're going to have a situation where, guess what? We have a majority in the United States Senate. But folks, look, the thing that's bothered me most, maybe emotionally bothered me the most, but substantially as well, losers and suckers. Just like all your sons and daughters, parents and grandparents who served. Folks who took out Bin Laden, along Bill McCraven, Admiral McCraven, along with two, 22 other four stars. They've endorsed me, saying they'd be proud to have me as their commander. The tough guy, the macho man, literally being laughed at. Putin's puppy. Putin, he's weak. God love him. Look, we have to meet American consumers switching to clean electric vehicles. We can own the electric vehicle market, creating millions of jobs here in Cleveland and in Ohio and in Detroit. Folks, and we will act in addition to deliver racial justice in America. Folks, protesting no, must never be tolerated, and it won't. The names of George Floyd. You know, I met with all these families. Well, I met with, with Floyd's little girl. I think she's six years old. I knelt down to say her, to be at eye level with her. And she looked at me and she said, I swear to God, she said, Mr. Vice President, my daddy is going to change in the world. My daddy's going to change the world. Folks, I'm not going to forget, you're not going to forget, and this country's not going to forget. But guess what? Because we have the X generation, I mean, the Z generation. Honk, if you agree with me that a $15 minimum wage is just necessary nationwide. 
Honk. Honk if you think assistance for a down payment for a real shot at home ownership should be coming forward with me with $15,000 for first-time homeowners. To start a small business, send the child to college debt-free. Folks, and look, look, you two have a duty, a duty to vote. Folks, I've said it many times. Donald care. 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 He's a 29-year-old kid. All the rest of the world combined, out of which all these new inventions have occurred. No other nation. We choose truth over lies. Folks, there's not a damn thing we can't do. Nothing.